Good morning, good evening, or good night, wherever you are watching from the world. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video, I wanted to do something, again, very different. This is something I've never done before. Um, I've seen kind of a lot of girls do this kind of unboxing video and showing off their designer bags and designer clothes. And I wanted to do something very similar, but kind of obviously like a male version. So I wanted to talk about luxury items and purchasing and buying that first expensive thing for yourself and how it's made me feel. And about a month ago, you may have seen on social media, because trust me, I was like, I got this, I got this. I purchased my first ever expensive luxury item and it was from Louis Vuitton. Now me personally, myself, I'm a very kind of high street boy when it comes to clothing and I have kind of evolved a little bit more into your Hugo Boss, your Lacoste, your Reese, your Cos, more kind of premium clothing. However, I still stick to kind of my roots of my top man's River Islands and clothing stores that you kind of generally just find down on the high street and your everyday person can really buy in that sort of sense like something that you can save up a bit of money and go and treat yourself but with me i've worked really really hard this year and i kind of felt like i wanted to treat myself and buying something so expensive really kind of doesn't come in my blood because it makes me feel sick when i spend that much money on a certain item and i think i kind of got that from my mum and dad because my mum and dad are completely the same. They're very much people that are saving for a rainy day, as you could class it, and spending £1,450 on a bag would be something that they would never do. And that is kind of how I've been brought up as well. I think I would always just go and buy a cheaper bag that would still look great, still last me, but it wouldn't be that kind of luxury expensive item. However, I, as I said, like I've had a really good year with work and I kind of felt like it was time to treat myself and I stumbled into Selfridges. I kind of maybe have planned it. And when I went to LA recently, a friend of mine had a Louis Vuitton bag and I don't know why I just fell in love with it. I know this is really weird to say, but I connected with the bag and I felt like it made me, like I wore it one day to a shoot and I don't know why it's weird, and if anyone's got a luxury item out there, you'll probably understand where I'm coming from. It made me feel good wearing it. I don't know why, it just made me feel good in myself. And I thought, I can't steal theirs. I can't feel like that when it's someone else's. I need to go and buy it myself. And that's what I did. I went into Selfridges. My parents were actually with me at the time, and they were very much against me getting anything from there. Until they realised why I was doing it for myself and that I deserved to purchase that item. I'm not someone that works in my industry with these big luxury brands. It was something that I wanted to buy out of my own pocket and deserve it and kind of treat it like it was my own rather than, oh, I got this for free. So yeah, I purchased my first bag, which I'm gonna show you now. And it, the way it makes me feel, I know this is really weird, the way it makes me feel is like, like I said, because you've saved up, and you've spent your own money on something that's quite expensive and well you're yeah, very much expensive for a bag it makes you feel like when you wear it like pride that you've got to take care of it because you've worked hard blood sweat and tears to purchase that item and also the feeling I get as well now don't get me wrong these people are not looking at me they're not looking at my bag going oh look at that flash devil over there it just generally makes you feel that way that when you wear something like this, it made me feel special. It made me feel like, damn, I've worked hard and I've, I, like, I've, look what I've accomplished kind of thing. And that might sound weird to some people. It probably will sound weird to many people, but I just feel like when I wear it, I just feel special. I feel good about myself. And the bag is beautiful as well, don't get me wrong. Um, so I went into Selfridges, I went for to, to Louis Vuitton, they treat you absolutely insane in there. It's a very different experience than walking in Top Man and saying, excuse me, where's your rucksacks? Um, they're like so kind of, you have to even put your name down on a list just to see a staff member. So you can't just walk in and grab someone, you have to put your name down on some kind of list. So this is the bag that I bought. It sits in this box and it only comes out on special occasions, so don't ask me why I spent so much money on something that actually only comes as a travel bag away with me. 
and I just took it to New York with me and it made me feel great. But um, yeah, there's the bag. And yeah, I don't know, it's weird, the feeling that it gives you. And it just gives you that special feeling. Everyone out there works hard in their own way. And some of us, a luxury item is not something as expensive as this. It's something that's maybe 40, 50 pounds. But I class it as a luxury item because it's something I've worked hard for what I can afford right now. But just because you spend 40, 50 pounds, that's still a luxury item to you because you've worked hard to buy and achieve and, and do that as well. Something I also want to do again that I want to keep up with every single month is I want to keep up with my Q&As because they seem to go down really well. It's nice to let you guys into my life. I'm a very open and honest person. I don't really hide much and a lot of my videos do tend to be sitting down on this bed and which by the way this is my house next room that i film in because it's better light and it's a cleaner whiter room it has got me in trouble in the past because i did a makeup tutorial and i had a dirty pillow or my housemate had a dirty pillow and all obviously the fingers got pointed on me but that's fine i've just told my housemate he needs to wash his pillows but yeah, I will be doing a Q&A very soon, so if there's anyone out there that's watching this video or watches all of my videos, please put your questions down below in the comments box and I will be answering some of them in about two or three videos maybe. But guys, thank you all for watching. Let me know what you think of the bag below. Let me know also if you bought yourself a luxury item and how did it make you feel? Did it make you feel special? Is it just me being a weirdo? Or am I kind of like on the same wavelength as everyone else, that when you buy yourself something special, because you deserve it. So thanks all for watching. I hope you did like it. Please give me a thumbs up. If you're a new person that's joined my channel, thanks all for joining. Please go and subscribe. Christmas is nearly here, so I'll be doing a few giveaways throughout December of maybe some fragrances and other bits and bobs maybe within the grooming category. So if that's something you wanna look out for and win, then please make sure you're checking out all of my videos in December. And guys, have a lovely weekend or week, whatever day you're watching this on, and I will see you all on the next video. See you then.